morning, everybody, and welcome to my little corner of the world here in beautiful St. Petersburg, Florida, U-S-A. Yeah, that's where we are. Again, we want to welcome all the new people who tuned in for the first time, and uh, you're part of our friendship. we got people from Arizona now, Texas, all over the country, in fact, all over the world. Thanks to you, it's working. So if you want to be a friend, you're, and, and you want to join us, remember, you're only a stranger one time. Then you're part of the family. That's what we're all about. So let me show you how easy it is to get back in shape, whether you're 5 or 85 like me. It's all up to you. Life can be beautiful, but it's up to you no matter where you are. But you have to start changing your thinking and changing your habits. Get rid of those bad habits and develop some good habits. I'm going to show you what to do. It's so easy. And again, it's so nice to see so many people ready to go. That's what I like. You're ready to go right with me. To come alive with exercise. So I want you to bend down, take a deep breath now. Bend down, inhale. Ah, oh, fresh air, oxygen. Great for the body. Staying alive. Enjoying life to the fullest. Even with all the problems we have around us. But remember, you don't have to join the, the doom and gloom crowd. You join me and stay alive. Down and stretch. One more time now, come on. Down and stretch. All right, posture so important. So stand nice and tall, stomach tucked in, feet shoulder width apart. Now extend your arms out. And I want you to go to the left side and hold. And over the right side and hold. That's it, Jeff, over. Are you there? Yeah, the computer guy, how about that? We got everybody exercising here. Again, forward and back and stretch. Now see if you can get down and touch the floor, okay? Down and up and down. You gotta bend your knees. You can't do that. You're gonna pull your back out. Bend your knees, come on. First hold it like that. Hold it. Are you there with me? Okay, now slowly go the other way and hold it. Get that arm up as high as you can. Very good, one more time. Down, stretch. These are so important to make you feel good all day long and enjoy the week and do things you thought you couldn't do. Down and rest. You know, a lot of people say, I'm too old, I'm too old. Keep, quit telling yourself you're too old. You're as old as you feel. If you feel old, you're gonna be old, but we're gonna help you feel young. Just join me in this next 20 minutes, okay? Now, back and forth your arms like it's one, and two, and three, and four, and one. Get them up a little bit higher if you can. If it hurts, back off just 10% and stay in that comfort zone. Again, over, back, one more, and rest. Now, go to the side, like your left hand on your hip, go over your head like this and hold. And then down again. Up over your head and down. And up. So if you're suffering from poor posture and headaches and uh, depression, you know, just join the people that are living. They'll get you excited, body, mind, and spirit. That's what we're all about. Again, over and relax. Now work that shoulder round, 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 round. Come on, you can do it. Pump it up. Come on, come on, prime that water. It doesn't come up unless you prime it. That blood's gonna circulate, okay, and rest. Now let's do the other side, okay? Are you ready? Uh, make a big circle, first of all. Round and around and around and around, and around, and around. Now, work that left shoulder, work it around. Come on, up towards your ears and make a circle, round, and up, and up, and up, and up, and up. You know, a lot of people suffer from poor posture. So it's important to always stand tall. Get yourself a full length mirror and look at yourself in the morning. Are you like this? Are you just worn out? So let's work on our posture. So, your arms up like this and go back as far as you can. Hold the stomach in, get that head back. Uh, you're having trouble doing that? Simple exercise, get that chair you have. Now we're gonna get rid of that Dowinger's hump. You know that hump, it's like a, hunch, a hunchback of Notre Dame. So I want you to go through your chair like this, hold on the top as far as you can. Try to get your head through there. You can feel this in the upper back and the shoulders and hold that position. Hold that position. That's it. Then up again, way up in your toes. Again, down, straight.
stretch nice and easy. Down, that's it. Stretch it out, stretch it out, stretch it out. Up again. One more time now, come on. Straighten out that neck. Down. Again, up. Up in your toes and relax. Try to balance on your one leg. Can you do that? Can you do that? Hold that down. Now try the other side. And if you don't have a good couple of pair of shoes on and you're wearing a couple of clothes, you, you say, what well, doesn't matter, Paul? I'm by myself. Nobody's here. I don't see anybody, but I'm by myself. Hey, I'm with you and I'm watching you. So get yourself a good pair of shoes. Wear something nice that makes you feel good. You know, when you dress up, you feel good and people give you compliments. But if you're running around with your tongs and bare feet and the same old, same old uh, top every day with all, called, all the menu on your front of your uh, blouse or uh, shirt, change. Nobody can make the changes except you. We're going to help motivate you. This is what makes you happy. Now place your hands on your hip and kick your kick feet out like this. It's kick back. Kick. It's what they call a kickback. Right. Yeah. Up. Down. Up, and I'm so proud of you people joining me every Monday, Wednesday, Saturday at 9 o'clock, live. And that's what we want. It gives you enthusiasm and builds up energy and the stamina and power and better thinking, positive thinking. Now, let's kick the can. Let's kick it one more time. Come on, kick that can. Don't kick the bucket. We only kick the can here. All right, now, do the other side. See if you can balance the one foot there. Can you do that? We gotta keep practicing. You know, practice makes perfect. Keep it going there. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. All right. All right. Now let's kick again. Maybe this leg's a little bit better and longer. It's kick. Get it up higher. That's it. A little higher. Again. Come on, Marlene. Nice to have you with me. In fact, it's nice to have all you guys with me because I need everybody I can get. I'm by myself here, all by myself. Just me and the, my angel right on the camera. Up, down, and up, down, now kick that can. Kick that can. Come on, boys and girls, keep up with Grandpa and Grandma. Kick and kick. All right, very good. Now, I want you to lace your fingers like this. We're going to make a large circle way up around. And go down, almost touching the floor. Down and up. Round, down, and up. Now stop there, and let's go from right to left. Down, concentrate now. Concentrate. See yourself doing it. If you, will you, remember, the mind can, will achieve no matter what the, whatever, what the mind conceives. Down. I got that boy. <laughs> uh, we all make mistakes, especially when you're about 85. But down, that's the wonderful thing about getting old. You can make mistakes. Down. Because a lot of people say, well, I'll never make that 85. Well, I didn't think I was going to make 85. I didn't think I was going to make it to 65. Down and rest. But you never know. God has a plan for you. So uh, always have a plan for yourself and believe in yourself. When you do that, you get results. Remember, thinking negative and being depressed and uh, saying I can't only affects you. It doesn't affect me. I'm going to say exercise, keep exercising because I feel good. And I want you to feel the way I feel, okay? All right. This time, let's have a seat there, okay? And I want to welcome all those new people. We're going to make a big circle with our right leg now. Around. And around. Get it up high now. Come on, you can do it. And hold it up there. Now hold it. Can you hold it? All right. Very good. Now let's reverse it. Reverse, reverse, reverse. Around. And around, and around, and around. Now the other side, here we go. One, and two, and three. If you're sitting on the sofa, move the body. Remember, nothing happens unless you make it happen. Now reverse, reverse, reverse. Round, 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 and rest. Now cross your leg like this. I know it's just a lean on your right knee there. Feel up that stretch in that upper thigh. Hold it. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Now work the uh, ankle round. Round, round. Put a smile on. You look so much younger with that smile. I know it's hard to smile when the things are happening negative around you and this virus seems to be getting everybody down, but don't let it get you down. As long as I have you, 
friends are forever, and friends can work together and encourage each other to stay alive around and rest. Now grab a hold of your knee and pull it up. Now pull a little closer. Can you get up to your shoulder there? So get down by your ankle there, and then slowly pull it up. Pull it up. Come on. A little more. A little more. A little more. Oh, I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. And I thought I couldn't do it. But remember, think positive, and positive things happen. Now on the other side, grab a hold of your, that's it, Bill. Nice to have you with us all the time. And I'm sure you're feeling better. It takes about 30 workouts. Now pull a little higher, a little higher. That's it, a little higher, come on. Now get a hold of your ankles there and pull that knee up to the shoulder and hold, 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 and relax. Whew. Now I want you to bend forward like this here and extend those arms out as far as you possibly can. Can I get them out there? Hold, and then clap underneath your knee. Underneath your knee, okay? Then back out again, work on those shoulders. Get that head down. Work on that posture. Hold, hold, down again one more time. Come on, we're gonna fly. Oh, we're gonna fly, Superman, Superwoman. That's it. Work it up and down, hold that position, and relax. Now for the back of the arms, they need a little extra uh, workout to stay firm and tone and give you that nice look. You know, a lot of people, I think they keep their money in the back of their arm here and they got just very brave, you know? So let's see what we can do. First of all, beginners, go back like this here and hold that stretch. Hold that stretch. Can you get them up high? Can you get them up higher? Hold it and then come forward like this and make a curl. Curl your, body, your arms and then get down and up. Curl up. Again, back, stretch, and then up. One more time, back, stretch, and up. All right. Do something again for the arms. The old push-ups, okay? So come down like this here and push up. It's down and up. Bend your knees, keep your shoulder width apart. Down and up and down and up and down and up and down and up. Now take a deep breath, inhale, blow it out, one more time, and blow it out. Now go to the right side with the leg, hold that leg out there. Hold it up, come on, you can do it. Down, now the other side, stretch great for that hip. Down, one more time, up, down, again up, and down. Now let's do some work out for the body, the, 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 the derriere, one, and two and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four. All right, Jerry, you take a rest there, and we're gonna get down the floor. Uh, you got your ball? <laughs> hey, coordination. I want you to go to the left side, with, lace your fingers, and go to the left side and hold. And way over the right side, you might wanna use a pillow. You have to have a pillow handy. Go to the left side, hold. You see, when you have something in your hands and your arms, you think you, you concentrate more because you don't want to drop it, right? You might break that uh, pillow. Again, over. Again, over. And relax. <sighs> now let's turn to the side. Rest your arm, right arm, and on your shoulder there. Bend your right knee. Left leg straight out and lift your left leg up like that and hold it. Great exercise for the thighs. Down. Again, up and down. Exhale up. Inhale down. <sighs> Remember, the greatest exertion, that's when you should exercise. I mean, you know, breathe out. <sighs> that's it. Out. Back. See, if you breathe properly and you do it regularly, you, you get dizzy. It's normal to get dizzy a little bit at first. You haven't exercised for a while. Now let's kick our legs, left leg forward and then back. Swing that arm back and forth. Swing line, swing low, swing high. That's it, over and over and over. Oh, that's getting heavy. Come on, Paul. Change your, changes the exercise. Now a couple more, you can do it. When you're tired, just stop. One more and rest. Now this time, that inner thigh is tough to work out, so place your hands back like this and raise your leg up like this. One, and two, and three, 
and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and now the other side. All right, here we go. There's two sides to every story. Here we go, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four. Now, can you put that right leg in front of the left leg? And look up towards this side there, hold that position, and then come back. Again, leg over and back. One more time, over and back. Feet together, arms out. Let's do our twist. One, and two, and three, and four. Hey, you're touching your toe. That's great. That's improvement. That's what we like to see. Everybody feeling better. I just want you to feel the way I feel right today, and you can by keeping yourself active and thinking positive. Again, over, one more, and rest. Flexibility is so important. So I want you to keep both feet together like this, and then stretch that right leg out as far as you can, and see the position it's in, what is it, about 45 degree? Let's see if we can get up to 90, okay? Swing back, a little further, and back, way out. Hold it. Ah, not bad, you're doing good, I'm, I'm so proud of you. Remember, it's so easy to quit. It's so easy to be lazy, but it's hard to stay in shape. But it's worth it. The rewards are fantastic. You'll feel good, you'll look good, and everybody can say, hey, what are you taking? You're not taking, so you're exercising. And remember, everything you do around the house is exercise. I always think of chores as exercise. In the future, we're gonna be showing you different things you do around the house, how it affects your body. Now let's go to the left side. Out and back. A little further and back. Way out and hold. Ah, oh, that is fantastic. All right, now, your feet flat on the floor and your hands facing the rear. Can you make a table? Let's get up and make a table, okay? I'll set the table, but lay it on top of your stomach there. That's it. Feel that in the back of the arms? Oh, mama mia. Hold. Down one more time. Up, hold, and down. Now this time, come up. Can you get your right leg out? Hold, and back, and down, and up. Left leg out, back, and down. Okay, let's turn around, and let's stretch that body again. Here we go, forward, and back, and forward. Oh, it feels good in that lower back. Can you stretch forward, and back, and forward, and back. Now, can you get on your elbows there, and get your straight, not your, and get the plank position there. You're like a triangle with your arms, and hold your feet, your toes are bent, hold that stretch, hold that stomach up, come on, hold it up, hold it up, and rest. Now for the derriere, let's place our hands together like this and do some flutter kicks. Here we go. One, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, and four. Now cross your ankles and curl up. One, for the back of the legs, two, three, and four. On the other side, reverse, reverse, reverse. Two, three, four. All right, extend your arms out. Chin touching the, uh, the floor. Raise your, your upper body off the floor and hold it for a couple seconds, and then down. Up, hold, that's it. One more time, down. Up, hold, and relax. On your knees like this, with the left side and the right side. It's over, it's over, touch that floor. That's it. Again, over. Come on, Melissa. Keep it up. You're doing good. That's it. TJ, come on. Keep up with Grandpa. Over. That's it, Troy. Stretch down. Remember, you're only as old as you feel. And if you feel older than 40 or 50 or 60, you better start doing something for yourself. Okay? Over and back. You know, a lot of people spend a lot of time in their car or with a pet or with a hobby. And what do they spend time with their body? Nothing. How, how long do you watch TV every day? One hour, two hours, three hours, five hours? And you're sitting and you wonder why you don't feel good? That's why. The body was made to be moved, be exercised, and then you're gonna get results and you can do what you wanna do when you wanna do it. Now lace your fingers. Here we go, the left side and right side, and left and right and left and right and left and right. Now hold the left. Hold the right. 
So one more time, hold. Again, hold and relax. All right, cardiovascular fitness. You can do walking, jogging, running, bicycling. So let's do some scissors. Here we go. One and two and three and four and one and two. Bend your elbows a little bit. That's it. Now you can do it at a 45 degree angle. That's it. In time, you've got to learn on how to do all this stuff. It didn't happen to me overnight. I worked and worked and worked. I started at age 14. I felt depressed. I felt uh, lonely. I felt uh, worthless. So come alive with exercise, and that's what it did for me after all these years. One more time and rest. All right, everybody up. Get a hold of that chair. That's it. Again, take your time. Focus in straight ahead. Take a deep breath, inhale. Blow it out. One more time. Blow it out. Now come down with your chin and touch your chest. Hold that. Can you see that? Okay. Now up. Oh, something cracked. Is that me? Down and up and down and up. Which way is the bathroom? It's over there. No, I think they moved it over there. I think it's over there. I, over there? I don't know. Now work around the circle. Okay, now the other side. That time goes so fast when we're together. I want to thank you for letting me spend this time with you in your home. God bless each and every one of you. Stay healthy. If you're not sure of yourself, check with your doctor. Then join us Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And also on uh, YouTube, the Paul Godino channel. That's Paul Godino Family Fitness Show. And we come right to your house and help you help yourself. Have a great week. And we'll see you this weekend, Saturday.